an old Datsun pickup truck. <laughs> Just a quick tap and everybody scream at the same time. No. <laughs> Kate's Park is pretty good. Have yeah, you ever been? No, I've never been there. Not a bad little spot. You're my tour guide, Matt. You're showing me a lot of places. Well, this is only the second place, the second time, the third time I've been down here, to be honest with you. So. Yeah. Have you ever done the kayaking? At, 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 I've, I've kayaked lots of times, but never here in Deep Cove. It's, you know, I mean, like I said, Deep Cove's beautiful, but I've never used these kayaks and that. I have a problem with a lot of kayaks nowadays, unfortunately. I like it I can't sound. fit in them. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> Most kayaks are not big enough for my legs. Oh, okay. And my, because, because my flexibility has suffered over the last few years, and especially in my legs, sitting at a 90 degree, yeah. I lose all feeling in my legs. So I can't do the multi-day kayaks or the multi-hour kayaks at the moment until I get my flexibility back. I prefer, I've always preferred canoeing though, over kayaking. Really? Yeah. I like how maneuverable you are in the kayak. It's awesome. You can be pretty maneuverable in a canoe too. Uh, I, I find it like the steering is more... Is more uh, it, 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 because like, because you don't have a paddle and a rudder, you are your paddle is your rudder in a canoe. It does take a little. It takes a lot of practice. Like even kayaking, you're not really because you just lean. You can just kind of lean. Yeah. But yeah, like I just find it. Yeah, you have to be a lot more finesse with your strokes with the canoe. Are we still on straight? Uh, yeah. Do you know where we're going, or am I just like, <laughs> sure. This is actually a really good place to eat right here. Where? This right in there. Oh, that looks quaint. This, yeah. It's a really good... Do you want to go there, or we're we just going to go down? Or yeah. We can go down in here. Okay, let's there's go a few. Down. There's a few down here as well. So Just keep going? Straight down to the very bottom. Oh, at the Straff? It's a nice, a nice place. Yeah. There's a lot of things in Canada named Strathcona. Strathcona, yeah. <laughs> it's a pretty common. Thank you to the British. Yeah. It's a very British thing. Strath. It's a uh, Strathcona is like something in the uh, UK. Yeah, it was a uh, an was area it, because there was the. Is the, it a, an area? Or it's, an, it's a family. Well, Lord Strathcona. It's it's an area because Lord Strathcona was yeah, like Lord of Lord Cornwall of and all that. They they give you that title as a part of but the, the area a, that you're in. Oh, okay, yeah. But I, I yeah I thought it I always thought of it as originating from like the family or whatever. But yeah, it's probably a region. Uh, I think yeah I think it's from the region and then the family adopts that because like okay, uh, yeah. like the Duke and Duchess of Cornwall. Yeah. Cornwall's the Cornwall area, yeah. but I I don't know that for sure for for certain. DB, you'd think if public speaking was my job, <laughs> with the way I've been mumbling all day. Is that a house? No. It's new. It was just foundations the last time I was here. It looks like it's going to be like a rental housing or something like that. Cove Gardens. Yeah. Now, now we find a place to park. <laughs> so if we go down to the end and turn right, there is a public parking lot down there if we can't find something along the streets. Okay. Yeah, he's recording. <laughs> yeah, you say hi to the camera. <laughs> Bonjour.